Kellen Kai Perry Acosta is an American soccer player who plays midfield for the U.S. men's national team and Chicago Fire FC. Acosta was raised in Plano, Texas. His father is Japanese-American, while his mother is African-American. Acosta's paternal grandmother is Japanese, and the surname Acosta comes from his Mexican paternal stepfather. Plano was an overwhelmingly white city when he was growing up. In his predominantly white neighborhood, Acosta said in 2022 he long tried to hide any evidence of his Japanese roots in order to blend in to avoid bullying or any confused stares at his multi-ethnic family. I wanted to fit in so bad there were times my Asian grandma would have to pick me up and park around the corner, he told NBC News. It was puzzling for some, and I kind of got made fun for it. His club career started with FC Dallas. Acosta played for the FC Dallas Development Academy and was committed to play soccer at the University of Maryland prior to becoming a home ground signing in July 2012 although he was not eligible for selection until the 2013 season. He did make three MLS Reserve League appearances in that time. He was named U.S. Soccer Development Academy Central Conference Player of the Year in 2011-12. Acosta made his first team debut in a 3-0 loss at Seattle in August 2013. He made nine consecutive starts from August to October of that season. His 2014 season was interrupted by a knee injury, unfortunately. He initially played fullback for the club, but eventually transitioned to a starting role as a defensive midfielder in 2015. Eventually, he matriculated over to the Colorado Rapids. On July 23rd, 2018, Acosta was traded to the Colorado Rapids in exchange for Dominique Baggi. Acosta started in all 12 league matches after joining Colorado, scoring two goals and adding three assists in Burgundy. On February 20, 2019, Acosta signed a three-year contract extension, keeping him in Colorado through 2021 with club options for 2022 and 2023. Acosta enjoyed similar success in 2019, making 30 MLS starts and playing 2,619 minutes, both career highs, while adding two goals and two assists. In a pandemic-shortened 2020 campaign, Acosta scored two goals and added one assist as he made 14 starts among 15 league appearances. Acosta scored Colorado's playoff clinching goal in a 1-0 win at Portland Timbers on November 4th. Acosta started and played 81 minutes in Colorado's MLS Club playoff first round loss to Minnesota United FC that year. Then he moved to Los Angeles FC. On January 14, 2022, Acosta was acquired by LAFC from the Colorado Rapids in exchange for $1.1 million in general allocation money. The Rapids would retain a portion of any sale should Acosta be sold elsewhere. Additionally, if certain performance-based metrics were met, Colorado would have received an additional 400 GAM. Acosta was born in the United States to a Japanese father and an African-American Puerto Rican mother and was eligible for Japan. Puerto Rico or the United States. After playing in the 2011 FIFA U-17 World Cup, Acosta became the youngest member of the U.S. squad at the 2013 FIFA U-20 World Cup. He was also part of the squad two years later at the 2015 FIFA U-20 World Cup. Acosta made his senior international debut for the United States in a friendly versus Iceland on January 31st, 2016. Acosta scored his first senior international goal in a 2-1 friendly over Ghana on July 1st, 2017, curling a direct free kick into the bottom corner for the eventual game winner. He was selected to the U.S. squad for the 2017 CONCACAF Gold Cup, which the U.S. would go on to win. Acosta appeared in five of six games, including all three knockout matches. Acosta made six appearances in international friendlies in 2018, scoring against Colombia on October 12th and assisting Josh Sargent's goal against Peru on October 16th. Following an almost 24-month absence from national team duty, Acosta was selected for a t December 2020 camp. On November 30th, 2020, alongside fellow Rapids teammates Cole Bassett and Sam Vines. Acosta replaced Sebastian Legette in the 68th minute of a 6-0 friendly win over El Salvador on December 9th at Inter-Miami CF Stadium in Fort Lauderdale, Florida. 
Acosta was called up again in January 2021 alongside Rapids teammates Vines and Jonathan Lewis, playing 90 minutes and assisting on Lewis's second goal in a 7-0 friendly win over Trinidad and Tobago at Exploria Stadium in Orlando, Florida on January 31st. During the 2021 calendar year, Acosta appeared in 21 out of a possible 22 matches for the United States, becoming the first player to do so since 1994. Acosta was a key member for the 2022 World Cup qualification, playing both central and defensive midfield. Acosta jointly led the U.S. men's national team along with Tyler Adams and Anthony Robinson with 13 appearances out of a possible 14 qualifiers. Acosta made the final World Cup squad, becoming the first Asian American man to appear for the United States in a World Cup, playing in matches against Wales and Iran. Acosta captained the U.S. To in a January 2023 friendly against Colombia, playing all 90 minutes in a scoreless draw. His career highs include three goals scored for FC Dallas in MLS in 23 games played back in 2017. His other league highs are five assists for FC Dallas in 2016. His career goals in MLS are 18 goals over his season from 2013 to 2023. And hopefully he can score a few more in a Chicago Fire jersey. Thanks for joining us here on Enemies of the Fire for this Kellen Acosta player profile. Kick that like button, comment below, and let us know. We'll see you on the next one.